Did you ever run the wilds, boy? Kirkwall is no city for a breed used to open spaces. Nice as your estate is, it's not healthy for a Mabari to be cooped up. May I take him to the barracks time to time? He could help train my guards. I'm yeah. sure he'll enjoy that. Thanks for the offer. Good. I think it's time they face down a good old Mabari charge. How about it, boy? Wanna chew on some recruits? <laughs> Yes, she wants a recruit. That night The outside of your house is so clean. Does someone wash it for you? Does I pay someone to take my shit? Let's get it! probably thought you'd got away with it. Sir Karas and the others' deaths. Do you even remember them? They were searching for the missing Starkhaven apostates and were murdered. An inquiry determined the apostates must have killed the Templars, but I've suspected for years that Sir Thrask and you were responsible. I have no proof. Suspect all you like, but you can't prove I was involved. You may have fooled the others, but not me. My brothers... Tonight, justice will be done. That's it. That's sad. But I got any revenge. With your little greedy locks.
some mage sent that thing here to kill him? Why would anyone... Oh, Maker. The murders. Emmerich was right. He was getting too close. He suspected a man named Gascard Dupuis. Did he do this? Yes, Gascard he played me. And now he's escaped to Darktown. Darktown's a big place, but we'll find him. He's an apostate, and Meredith will want him hunted down. I will speak to the city guard about this. Gascard Dupuis will not escape. Imagine Orzammar is like this, only with beards and an overwhelming sense of superiority. And that will, uh, stop the itch. Yes. Though I would stay away from women you meet in the port. Pirates tend to... dock in unsavory places. Just use the salve if it comes back. Uh, excuse me. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Things just keep getting worse. I had Templars practically on my doorstep the other night. They're after you? The Templars are hunting you. Not me specifically. They were just checking the refugee camps. But it's not like this place is a secret. It's only a matter of time. Oh, you need a safer place. Oh, don't tell me these things. I might have to lock you up to keep them off you. Sweetheart, I'm not letting anyone lock me up. You included. The Knight Commander is out of control. Even her own people have been talking about it. The curfews, the midnight raids on mages' families. Everyone I know forced into hiding so they won't be made tranquil. I'll keep if you they then. want you, they'll have to come through me. Just being with me puts you at risk. The Knight Commander has declared supporting apostates a hanging offense. The thought of them hurting you. Everything I've done to control this. I don't care. I would drown us in blood to keep you safe. Stay in control. I don't want to see you lose yourself. To the Templars or justice. How much is left if you strip both those out? I'm sorry. I can't be anyone but who I am. There will be more violence. I know that. If you tie yourself to me, I'll only hurt you. Uh. Promise, a promise is promises. You keep saying that. You haven't yet. You could have a normal life. You don't want to be with an apostate. Don't tempt me. Not unless you're ready for what that means. The Templars have become more active in their hunt for me. I won't be able to stay here long. Oh, uh, the guy's gonna be in Dark Town. Yes, uh. another. Ah, oh, 
finish well. Good time. I think I bought everything that I need. I buy some stuff around. Do you think people will ever start calling it the Hawk Estate? You got my letter. You've been gone a while. I thought you had things under control. I told you I would handle this, and I did. Now, after a year of raids on our shipments, I finally caught one of the culprits. One of our miners, Sabine, has been leaking information. Do you know him? He claims to be from your hometown in Ferelden. I would like you to get this festering saw to divulge who is behind the theft. When you are ready, I will bring Sabine to you. Hey, let's bring go. Sabine back to my place. Excellent idea. I will get him now. <laughs> Here is the dung pile I caught leaking next week's shipment schedule. He won't tell me who is working with. Who else has been screwing me over? Tell me, you ratting mongrel! Instead of beating the poor man, let's appeal to his better nature. Please, Miss Sir, help me. I knew you since you was young and lothering. I knew your mum's family and your pop. Mike, you got him rest. Pathetic. <laughs> I leave this bastard in your capable hands. Get me when he's ready to talk. Thank you, Monsieur. A slothering folk should stick together. Why did you do what it? What made you betray your employer? Before the blight, my family had a good life in Lothering. Clean home, fertile lands, friends. In Kirkwall, we lived in a hovel. People spit on us. And some days, we went hungry. Uh, sure, blah, blah, blah. I know it was hard to leave Lothering. Talk to me, so we can put all this behind us. As soon as I tell Hubert what he wants to know, he'll kill me or throw me in prison. My life's not worth much, but my family. I only wanted to give my wife and son a better life. I'll help you. I'll deal with you, Ben. Just give us something to go on. Oh, thank you, Monsieur. I'll talk. Hawk, this is Lily of the Coterie. Given the importance of stopping the cargo robberies, I have enlisted a consultant. Consultant? Sure. Whatever helps you sleep at night. Well, Doug, are you ready to bark now? There's an ambush planned tonight at Dietrich Crossing. Tonight? That leaves you barely enough time to intercept them. You had best leave immediately. We'll protect your precious shipment, but make sure you have the coterie's payment. Want me to deal with this runt? Free of charge. I'll drop him in a ditch on our way out. Yes, take him. With my blessing. I assume my partner will not object. Or let him save him. showing of mercy will be good for morale. Let him go. But he's a Pharrell, a criminal. Nobody will care what happens to him. Think about it. Sabine turned to crime for two reasons. He's desperate, and he bears no love for you. Spare him publicly, and you'll earn some loyalty from the miners. I see your point. Very well. For the sake of morale, I will spare this dog. Oh, 
Thank you, Miss Hayes. I know I don't deserve it, but thank you. We're wasting time. If you find naught but corpses at the ambush, it won't be my fault. We're too late for your boys. But we <laughs> That was almost too easy. Wait, I recognize that lout. Who is he? He's in the coterie. One of that damned fool Brecker's men. Oh. This time to meet Brecker. Let's Bar pay Brecker a social call. We've got a lot to talk about. I've got to be sure first. I know who to lean on to get answers. Find me in the Undercity. Get away. You coterie, one of Lily's friends. Lily was one of ours. She was working for you and now she's dead. You get one chance. Did you kill her? It was dead when I got Lily here. didn't die by my hand. Someone else did this. Explain yourself. Parker's obvious. This is a case of the right hand not knowing what the left is doing. One of the scum that attacked my caravans worked for someone in the coterie named Brecker. Lily said she'd look into it. I think Brecker had her killed. Brecker, hmm. If you're lying, I'll find you. Men, we have to get to the bottom of this. Now. Inside you. Turn up your purses, Kurtwall. The leases of Javaris Tintop are up for grabs.
Oh, poor mage. Never handle it. You must be Brecker. And you're that lice covered refugee. Stop attacking my shipment. You'd better leave the bone pit shipments alone. Understand? You're making demands of me. You own half the stake in a mine and you think you're somebody, huh? Some Ferelden's don't have the courtesy of knowing when to bloody die. Get back! Killed everything in here. Do for you, Alma. You add this together, right? Then you minus it, right? Add it, then you minus 600, and you be it with M, you pause something. So I'm sure to move this over here, and that's it. Um... 